Hello everyone, how are you all? This is Ego Tech Giant from England. Today I am going to be showing you one of the best free apps which you don't have to pay to use to record the screen of your Android mobile phone. In case if the original one that comes with your phone is not working well or if you can't locate it. So I am going to show you the basic things that you need to know about the software to use it to record your phone screen. Also, I am going to show you how to locate the original screen recorder that comes with your phone. And I will show you how to get the things that you had recorded, how to locate the storage. But as you continue to watch, if you like our videos, please, you can subscribe to our channel if you haven't. Then click on this arrow to be able to click on this bell, which says all to be able to be notifying you as soon as we upload any new video. Share our videos and click the like button under this video. Now go to your Google Play Store, which is this. Click on it. Then come here, type AZ Screen Recorder. As soon as you type this, AZ Screen Recorder, then you search for it. You hit enter. It searches, which is this. Screen recorder hyphen AZ recorder. Then install. It has installed. Now you can open it from here or go and look for where it is on your phone screen which is this. You can see it. AZ Screen Recorder. Click on it. Then you can click on this Allow. Allow pop-up button. You can click on this. Then highlight this. Don't ask again so that it will not ask you again. Allow. Then as I normally do, you can just bring it back because it asks you display over other apps. But you can just bring it back here or here for it to go back. You click this OK. Then you can also allow. Allow here as well. Then you can come to the setting which is this Click on here, then resolution. I normally like 1080p. Then video quality. Choose whatever you want. Then orientation, which is so important. Now, if it is on landscape, which means it can cover the screen of your desktop computer or television whereby it will give you wide screen. But if you click on portrait, will be straight, whereby you have to keep your phone upright, straight. But if you put it on landscape, you can put your phone flat so that it will display well. So, but let me leave it on portrait. Then audio, choose whatever you want. Then you can now come here, then click on this to start recording. I click on it. Click on allow. Then click on start now. Now you can see it is recording, which you can stop it here 
or you go to your phone drop down menu to click either stop or pause which are this then maybe let me record from my youtube perhaps i go to this is my camera imagine if i want to copy this So, as you can see, I can record anything from my phone. Then, as I said, you can go to your app. So long as I click here, it stops. Let me stop it now. Now, I can play the video from here or I go to my file manager. This is the file manager that comes with your phone internally. So I can click on this place, which signifies folder, but on some phones. So long as you click on file manager, you will see here internal storage or SD card lined here. Or, but on this kind of phone, you have to click on this that looks like a folder which this is your storage and this is your SD card or you can come here to swap so long as you click here to swap in the SD card or internal storage so once you come to your movies here this is where it is this is the video az screen recorder this is the video but in case if your file manager that comes with your phone if you don't understand it you can download this which is another file manager which has f as a logo in the middle so it appears like this main storage or sd card which you go to your main storage then movies az screen recorder this is the video let me play it now this is my camera imagine if i want to copy this also to get the best audio if you go to your setting and Make sure that when you are inserting any external microphone, make sure that it is on microphone instead of on anything else. Otherwise, it will not give you a good audio. Now, I will show you how to record with your inbuilt screen recorder inside your phone. It normally situates here. If you come to your drop down menu, look for where it says screen recorder, which is this screen recorder. So long as you click on it, it begins. Or you look for where it is on your phone screen. But on some phones, you may not find it on your phone screen which you have to use your finger to roll on top of your phone to get to your drop-down menu as I showed you before. Then search for where it says screen recorder, which is this as I showed you. So on some phones, the moment you click on it, you will see a button that says start recording or you will see a button, red button, that you can use to start or stop recording. Just almost similar to the AZ screen recorder that I showed you. So, the moment it stops recording, then you go to your file manager to look for where it has stored. 
but there are different phones. Your own phone may not seem this way. But in most cases, many screen recorders that come with your phone, we always store on the file manager which has DCIM. So if you go to your internal storage, which is this folder DCIM, then this is where it normally stores screen recorder. This is what it recorded before. Or as I said before, you can download this kind of file manager which has F in the middle. Then you can always come to your main storage DCIM. Then screen recorder, this is where it normally stores. I mean the screen recorder that is inbuilt on your phone. So please, as I said before, if you like this video, do not forget to subscribe to our channel if you haven't. And also click the like button under this video. That is how you can help us to continue doing excellent videos for you and also share our videos with anyone you wish. Thank you.